Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, Manvi Tips. In upcoming videos, we are going to be taking you through the world of sketching of human anatomy. But particularly in this video, I'll be focusing on head and face. I promise it is easier than you think. You don't need any fancy supply, just a sketchbook and a pencil is enough. So grab on to it and let's get started. Today we will do a study of a head. As explained before, the head is always divided into three parts. Whether the head shape is oval, square, circle or a heart shape. After sorting out the position of the eye, nose, lips and figuring out the distance between them, you have to see from which point of view you are looking at that person. Is it from above, from below or side view? The line direction will form a curved line accordingly. I think more than you guys, this fly is more interested in my lecture. I can see it's buzzing around me. Well, well, I don't mind as far as you press the like button. A very quick and easy tip to make you understand this. Take a ball. Imagine there is a band around it. Imagine the curved line as a band around a sphere or an oval. See how when you look at a ball, the band changes. Similarly, the head movement will determine the change in the band direction. The best way to understand is there are two lines, vertical and horizontal. Horizontal line changes when you look up and down, the curve tilts accordingly. And the vertical line changes as per the side view. Which means if you are going to look your, from right to left or left to right, the line is going to tilt as per it. There are few key elements like like the eye always meets the start of the ear and the lips the end of the ear. Then after sorting, in other words, studying the head, you may add details. Now the question is, how to make lips, eyes and nose for those details wait for the next video. Thank you for watching Manvi Tips.